Hello, this is Grant Bilker, coming to you almost live with my parabolic mirror experiment. Here it is. Here, we have the parabolic mirror. And here we have a bright light. The sun. So we position the parabolic mirror so that it gets the sun. Then we put the wood in the front of it. That is just a first-hand look at how the parabolic mirror works. It's very powerful, much more powerful than the magnifying glass, even though much less accurate. Let's take a look. The sun seems to be a little bit too sh uh, weak today, so I had to help up the ante by putting black marks on the piece of wood. This will increase the uh, amount of power that can go into the wood. Here we go. I guess right now the sun's not powerful enough because it takes the surface tension on top of here. The amount of uh, surface area that the actual device has, the more sunlight it can take in and then convert into energy, heat energy. As where the parabolic mirror has much more surface area and therefore can... Um, create a much larger energy beam. This concludes my project.